Hey, what's going on guys? Knife Guy coming at you with another GTA 5 glitch video. This one here, guys, we got three new glitches for you. People have been asking for them. It's going to be how to get pearlescent on a gun, how to get the vest with no sleeves on them, and also, simple one, how to get two patches. So one on the front, one on the back of your shirt. Before we get started, guys, if you don't mind, go ahead and throw a like on the video if you do enjoy it and you found it useful. Go ahead and subscribe to the channel if you are new. Share it on Facebook and Twitter with all your friends. Other than that, let's get to it. Alright guys, so first one we got lined up here is going to be the vest glitch. So what you want to do is go ahead and save any vest with any outfit. Save it as one of your outfits. When you got that done, go ahead in now, go to coveralls. Select any one of the coveralls, you don't have to save it as the outfit, you just want to put it on. Once you got the coveralls on, you want to go ahead downstairs, if you're in your apartment, if you're down at the beach, to head to any one of the telescopes. All you want to do is, as you're walking by the telescope in your apartment, push right on the D-pad, it'll glitch out the head. So you'll notice now that the mask and the hood is off the coveralls. Go ahead and pull up your select menu, go down and swap out the outfit with the vest that you want to use. So once you got that done, same as usual guys, go ahead and walk away from the telescope, it'll glitch out now, it'll give you the mask, but you'll have the other original vest outfit on. Once you got this, you know everything's working good so far guys, go into your body armor, put on any body armor, it does not matter which one, make sure it's on and it is visible. Once you got that done, go back up to your closet, go in, save this outfit now as a second outfit. So you're going to have two saved outfits essentially. Once you got that saved, what you do is pull up your phone, go ahead and start any one of the captures. It does not matter which one, this part probably take the longest out of anything guys. I had to wait a total of about 5-6 five, five, minutes for this one, it wasn't too bad. You'll know it's working though, once you do load into the actual job, you'll notice that all your upper arms are completely invisible now, which is perfect. So what you want to do is go ahead and pull up your interaction menu one more time guys, go in, take off the body armor now, so you'll notice now you have no body armor, you do have the vest and you have no upper arms. Last thing you do, go back now, go into accessories, put on any glove you want. Doesn't matter which glove it is, just go ahead and swap out and put on a set of gloves. Now you'll notice your arms are completely visible and the glitch is almost done guys. Last little bit you want to do is go ahead and pull up your phone one more time. You can either complete this or you don't have to, I just show it's a lot easier if you don't do it. Pull up your phone, push square, cancel out the job, it'll load you back into online now. When you load online, one last thing guys, pull up your start menu, go ahead and swap out your hat, your glasses, do whatever you want so you don't have to necessarily wear that mask. Once you got that done guys, go down to your clothing shop, save up the outfit, and you're good to go. Let's get on to the next one. Alright guys, so this one here just came out not too long ago. Everybody's been asking about it, how I got it on my gun. It only lasts for the one lobby that you're currently in. So super simple, super quick. What you want to do is go ahead and grab the Combat MG. It is the only gun that it works on currently, unfortunately. Go ahead and select the pink color. Unfortunately, like I said, this is the only gun it works with, and it's also the only color it does work with. So go ahead and select the pink. Once you have that selected, go up and select the engrave. Once you have that selected, go ahead outside pull out the gun, you'll notice now for some reason it's completely blacked out but you do have an etched logo on it. So what you want to do at this point is you know it is working properly, go ahead and pull up your start menu, join a new lobby. Before you join the new lobby though, before you do all this, make sure that you do have your last location set as last location. Reason is you'll spawn in your apartment and it won't work. So this one here is go ahead, once you load into the new lobby, you're pretty much set and good to go guys. Pull up the gun, you'll notice that it's red. It gives you just a little bit different look to it, really nice to set up some pictures and some scenes. Unfortunately, like I said, once you do leave this lobby a second time, it does not stick on your gun. And like I said, also, this is the only gun it currently works with. Let's get on to the next one. Alright guys, so the last piece we got here is going to be how to get two crew emblems on a shirt. So what you want to do first is go in and select your crew t-shirt. Uh, if you guys want the completely blacked out one, I know it looks a little bit funny, but this is a glitch uh, color, which allows you essentially to get the Patriot tire smoke on your vehicles too. So go ahead and check out the other videos to get that. So what you want to do here is once you have your crew outfit on, go ahead and select the back emblem. So your back emblem's on. As you can see, my tattoo does show through, but we could fix that after. Once you got the emblem on, go up to the counter and save this outfit. Doesn't matter what you call it, just save the outfit. Go back now to your clothes, go into the tops, and what you want to do is hover over whichever one you want. So go ahead and select whether it's the chest tattoo, whether it's the top small emblem on your chest, any one of those will work. Go ahead and select that. Once you got that one selected now, head back to the counter one more time, talk to the lady at the front, scroll through all of your actual saved outfits. You don't want to select any of them, just scroll through the outfits once, you'll notice right when you get back to the top, 
back out of it. Don't select anything. Once you back out of it, for some reason it'll actually glitch now, where you'll have the emblem on the front, and you'll also have it on the back of the shirt. So go ahead, jump back into the counter, save the outfit, and you're good to go, guys. Just a quick way to get the emblem on the front of the back of the outfit, if you guys do want it. If you want to get rid of the tattoo on the back, if it does glitch out, just go to the tattoo shop and take it off. Other than that, guys, hope you enjoyed the video. Don't forget to throw a like, share, subscribe to the channel, as it always does help. Share it on Facebook and Twitter with all your friends. Other than that, see you next video, guys. Peace!